Which assignments were the most thought provoking to you and why? The assignments that were most thought provoking um, for me were the business memo activity um, because I didn't really know how to format a business memo. So learning how to uh, how to write one was beneficial so I can use that information in the real in real world situations. And also was making um, a video conveying a negative message. This taught me how to address um, a negative situation using proper tone and, and ethical language. Which assignment was most thought provoking for you and why? For me, I found the job search activity, developing a well-constructed report and the interview activity. These were the most thought provoking for me as I had a vague idea of how to do these assignments, but I got to do very in-depth research, teaching me more about this topic and making me a better businessman. The job search activity allowed me to update my resume and cover letter, make my brain work to think about all the skills I've acquired while working over the last three years. Developing a well-constructed report was a new topic for me. I had never seen anything like this. From completing this assignment, I learned a lot as I covered a lot of new information and practiced the format of a constructive report. The interview activity made my brain work highly as I had to answer questions about myself and my personal skills relating to a job that I want. I had to think about my recent experiences I've had and situations I've been in that would make me perfect for the job. How has your perspective or understanding of cross-cultural communication within business situations been changed, challenged, reinforced or deepened? My perspective has changed in the understanding of cross-cultural communication in business uh, situations um, through the importance of it. it um, having an understanding of the culture of the person you're working with can greatly help business relationships. Knowing the similarities and differences of each other's uh, cultures can create a stronger business bond as well as create new business opportunities. Which um, perspective or understanding of cross-cultural communication with business situations have been challenged or reinforced or deepened for you? My understanding of cross-cultural communication has deepened greatly. Before studying this course, I did not have much knowledge on business, as I had only studied it for a short period a few years back. I have learned a lot about different cultures and the ways to effectively communicate through these by taking this class. All of the knowledge I've gained is new to me. I've got to learn about language, cultural norms, geographic location in relation to cross communication. I also got the newfound knowledge of why it is important. It helps people to avoid miscommunication and misinterpretation. Review the courses you are enrolled in for the upcoming session. How does what you've learned in this course connect with the content to be covered in your upcoming courses? Um. So I will be taking um, Composition 2 and Corporate Finance. So I feel like there's going to be a lot of like um, formal like um, writing documents that are going to need to be written. And we've covered that a lot in this class. So I think that'll um, help me in those future classes. Oh, sorry. How does what you learn in this course connect with the content to be covered in your upcoming courses. Academic communications and the principles of microeconomics are two of my new courses that I'm enrolled in for the upcoming session. My newfound knowledge from this course will help me in these classes as academic communications relate to the methods of communication. From this course, I've learned that there are many ways to communicate, email, text, phone call, business memo, and through a report. I've also learned how to professionally communicate at work, making sure all conversations are polite and have a positive tone to create a productive workspace. How do 